my spice my spicy uh, hey my spice girls my spicy mamas how are you guys doing today and if you can tell by the title we are finally going to be doing our first challenge i'm excited you guys like my hair i'm iffy about it i don't know i have a big ass head so i don't know if this is cute what do you think what do you think mm -hmm. but you know, it's October 2nd. I wanted to throw on the Halloween colors. You already know. You already know. And yeah. So enough rambling. We just going to get into the video. That was a really short intro. But if you are new to this channel, please like, subscribe. So you could become a member of the Spice Spicy girl, spice mamas. I don't know what you guys want me to call you yet. Do you guys like spice girls or do you like spicy mamas? Yeah. But yeah, let me know down in the comments which one do you like. But yeah, if you're new, please subscribe. And yeah, because why wouldn't you want to subscribe? I mean, you're already here, so just click the subscribe button. I mean, it's free, so yeah. But if you're new, hello, my name is Kalini, aka Spicy K, because no one ever knows how to pronounce my name, so I just put it as Spicy K because I'm a little bit spicy, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but, alright, enough rambling because I just want to get on with the challenge, I'm excited. Alright, so this challenge is random numbers picks my makeup but eyeshadow really so yeah so i got a cup it's so cute my mama bought me this it's so freaking cute and this has been my favorite mug or whatever you want to call it and yeah it's so cute anyways um in here is a bunch of papers that i have numbered from 1 through 39 and i will be using the morphe and james charles palette for this challenge just because it has i'm trying to open it okay just because it has a lot of colors to play with and yeah this has 39 shades so i was like we're gonna take this palette out and we're gonna use it for this challenge okay so if you don't did I explain the challenge? Anyways, you pick, you put as many numbers as the palette that you're using in here. So 1 through 39 is in here. I wrote it down and I just put it in this little mug. And I will be picking out four, no, I'm going to pick out, I'm going to pick out five numbers, five random numbers. And what num whatever number it is, I'm going to count from the palette and whatever number it is. You know, like this will be number one and this and the last shade will be number 39. So you get it, you get it. If I pick number three, one, two, three, I'm using this shade. You know, you get it, you get it. Yaddy yaddy yaddy. Yaddy yaddy yaddy. So yeah. So enough rambling again. I've been rambling throughout this whole intro. But let's just for real, for real, get on to the video. The video. The video. I'm so scared. Okay, so you ready? Get ready? I'm scared. Oh, okay, so I'm gonna take out a number. Oh, I'm scared. I don't wanna do this. Okay. I got one. Okay. We were gonna open it. Number 39. That's that pink shade that I showed you guys. Oh, uh, this one. I'm going to be using this color. This is color 39. Uh, why you do me like this? The makeup guys, why you do me like this? I want to use pink. Okay, next, next color. Since this one fell out, I'm going to use it. Okay, this is our second color. 16 is our second color. So let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 
16? 16? Bro, no way. A pink and a brown I got. Girl, this is not going. Uh, okay. Now for our third color. Oh my god, what a scarred. Okay. Okay. Our third color. Let's pray. It's a good color. Number 34. Okay, so this is 39, 38, 37, 36, 35, 30. That's number 34. <coughs> mm. Mm. This is going to be bad already. I can see it. All right, a fourth color. Okay, our fourth color. Oh my god, number 38. This is 39, 38. So, so far, I'm using a pink, this brown shade, this color right here. And this color, purple. I'm trying not to cry right now. This is gonna be another disaster video. Stay tuned. Okay, our last and final color, which is the fifth color. I don't know why I need a fifth color, but let's just do it. Let's just, our last color. Oh, 37. Are you freaking kidding me? All of these are in the 30s. Can I like redo this? Like, I'm not going to cheat. All right, 39, 38, 37. So another purple color. What? I am not happy with the color choices that I picked out. This is freaking ridiculous. How did, how in the world did I pick all, almost all my colors in the 30s? And then I swatched all the colors in the back of my hand so it'll be easier for me to like decide what the heck I'm gonna freaking do, freaking create with these colors. Like, This is gonna be a mess. This is gonna be a mess. I can't, I can't even. Okay. Let's just get started. Thanks, Cup. Let's just get started on this video. All right, y'all, so I did my eyebrows off camera and I concealed them. I should have did that before I even recorded it, but. I was excited to get into this video until I found out what colors I got. Anyways, I can't see. I'm blind. At the, but these are the colors I'm working with. I don't know what the frick to do. I'm going to come back and I'm going to think about it. I'm going to come back. I'm gonna come back. So we're going to take this brush. And we're going to start off with the dark purple, which is right here. This look is already going to be a fail. I can see it already. Okay. So we're going to focus this on the crease. The above the crease. This purple is patchy. I'm not even a pro at makeup, so I shouldn't even be doing this challenge. Like, I'm a pro or some she. Okay. 
but it's fine. We'll get through it. Okay, so I packed on the purple. I feel like my ring light is so bright right now. Yeah. So next we're going to take that pink color or whatever. I was going to do it in the crease, but I think I just want to do it in the outer crease. So we're going to take the pink because I'm really not a big fan of this pink. So, but we got to work with it because I picked it out. Okay. So I was going to do it in the crease, but I think I just want to focus it on like the outer and just blend it in with the purple. Just like this. So it makes like a nice purple effect. Boy, I like it. And then blend the two together. So the more I try to blend out these colors, the more they like fade away. I don't know. But the next color we're going to use is that brown color. That brown color. Um, we're going to use this brush. Okay, the brown color is this one. I'm just going to focus this on the outer crease. Just like that. I'm just packing it on. I don't really want to rub it in because I already know it's just going to lose its pigment. And yeah. So outer crease. The outer corner. How do you think this look is going to turn out? Tell me down below. Do you think it's going to be like, come on, nice and wearable or like, no. It's just, I should just stop YouTube. Okay, so the brown is on. Now I'm just going to take this big brush and just blend it, the edges, so it's not like too harsh. that oh, this looks horrible oh my gosh okay okay now i'm gonna cut my crease yeah i thought y'all was not feeling good today i was not feeling good today i wasn't even feeling good yesterday i was like but I have to film, like, I literally feel like I'm going to pass out. Like, I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's because I'm hot. I haven't eaten really good yet. Ugh. It's like I'm dying. Okay, so I'm going to cut my crease. Okay, so tip on cutting your crease i have hooded eyes so my eyelid folds so what i like to do is go over my fold when i cut my crease so i'll usually just put it right here look up or like i don't know move your freaking eye look down whatever and where it stops right there is where i like to cut it but i like to go a little bit more up because I know how my eyes are and yeah but that's only I only like to go that high so it doesn't transfer to the top and mess up my top of my eyelid that I just worked so freaking hard on so yeah so that's just a little tip if you have hooded eyes 
so maybe I wasn't the best at demonstrating but that's just how I like to do that's just how I like to do my cut creases everyone likes to do it different depending on your eye shape or whatever but I like to think that I have hooded eyes because I have hooded eyes don't I mm. I do all right but anyways just cut your crease or whatever well I'm cutting my crease who would recreate this look because this is a mess but i'm trying my hardest i really am so yeah okay so there we go i need to fix this eye because look it transferred Ugh. all right so now that my cut crease is cut See, you see, I like to take my pinky and blend the brown. Just tap the outer corner where the end of the concealer is so your pinky can blend the brown and the perp and the concealer together. So there's not a harsh line there. You see how it just blended perfectly? Look at me, thinking I don't know what I'm talking about. But yeah. I got concealer everywhere. What are you doing? Okay, so now I'm going to take my, not my last shade, but that shimmer shade. The only shimmer shade that I freaking have. Okay, I'm going to take this flat brush and this shimmer shade. ugly shimmer shade so ugly and I'm gonna spray it and I'm gonna pack it on <laughs> oh my god I really don't like it Anyways, I'm taking the same brush that I used the brown on and I'm just mixing the brown and that freaking blue together. There's nothing that I can do to make this look even worse. So I'm just gonna deal with it. And now for the last color, which is oh the dark purple. So then I'm going to put it under my eye, but first I want to do my face. So I'm going to do my face off camera and I'll be right back. Alright, so I just start raining out of nowhere, like pouring, pouring, pouring. Alright, so I did my face off camera. That highlight though, okay? And I added some lashes. This reminds me of the mermaid look that I did. That's what this reminds me of. But anyways, down for our last color, which is this freaking dark purple. Okay. So this dark purple is our last color. And I'm just going to use that for my bottom lashes. I'm just going to smudge it. Smudge it. Yep. You guys hear the rain? And I did add highlight to my inner corners. Is that cheating? I don't know. Okay, and then mascara on the bottom lashes.
And then lipstick. Let's just, I was gonna pick out a, pick out a number and yeah, but I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. I don't know what color. Let's do this one. Thank you. Why are almost all my videos a mess? I don't know. But I don't feel good. I just want to finish this video. <sighs> All right, so. Okay. All right, guys, so this is the finished look. You guys like this look. This was honestly a challenge for me. Uh, but I don't know, I like it, but I wish it wasn't like a resemblance of my mermaid look. Like I wish it was just something different. But comment below if you want me to do a part two to this. And maybe instead of me picking out the numbers, I will have my fiance pick out the numbers instead. So if the look comes out ugly, I can just blame it on him instead of myself. So, comment down below if that's something you guys would like to watch. I am getting so freaking good at my freaking face makeup. It's ridiculous. Like, oh, look at that freaking contour. Look at that freaking blush. And look at that highlight. It blends together beautifully. This side is kind of patchy, I think. I don't know. But, yeah. I'm getting good at my makeup. I'm proud. But, yeah, this is the look. Don't mind the lashes. I just plop them on because, like I said, I do not feel good. I literally feel like I'm going to faint. Like, ugh. it's so hot. Like, I easily get, I easily get sick and nauseous and just days that I just don't want to do shit. But, yeah, I needed to do, I wanted to do this challenge so bad, so yeah so do you guys like this look comment down below and let me know and let me know if you guys want me to do a part two to this because i actually had a lot of fun hopefully part two i would have some more different colors to work with and yeah this if you haven't done this challenge i think you should do this challenge because it'll get you out of your comfort zone if you're not like into colors or something or even if you are it's just something fun to do for the channel and yeah this is my first challenge on my channel and i had so much fun doing it i'm so excited that this month is october october is like my favorite time of the month besides christmas i mean hello um but yeah fall season is where it's at where it's at so yeah and i just noticed i never brushed off the dust sorry but yeah comment down below if you guys like the video and if you're new to my channel please don't forget to like this video subscribe and watch the rest of my videos on my channel so yeah um what else i don't want to go but yeah this was fun so I challenge you guys, you YouTubers out there, to do this challenge. Okay? So do it. I challenge you to do it. Come out of your comfort zone and just have fun with it. And yeah. So peace out. I love you guys so much. And... Oh my god, I don't want to go. 
But yeah, I love you guys so much. So peace.